Hi guys, thanks for tuning into this car tech video. In this video, I'm going to show you really, really simple mileage correction in a Ford vehicle. Um, this is the X Tool X100 Pro 2 kit, and I'm going to put a link to this kit in the description below this video and also in the comments box below. So it's a really simple to use mileage correction tool um, via the OBD2 port. One end is plugged into the tool and one end of this cable is plugged into the diagnostic port underneath the dashboard there. So yeah, so mileage correction on a Ford, uh, you, you probably notice that we're not in a Ford right now. I don't have a Ford to hand, um, but the process I'm going to show you is exactly the same with your specific vehicle. So with the, with the tool plugged in, we're just going to click on the dashboard option. Just click OK. I'm going to select your vehicle. So um, Ford is probably going to be in the, I think it's in the American section, I believe. It's not shown on this list here, but in any case, the process I'm showing you is exactly the same. Um, so we're just selecting our vehicle. Uh, backup and mileage, so it's in miles. And what you can do is set up a backup file. So if you make a mistake, you can go back to the original mileage of the car. Now I've already done that here. You can see there, 01.bin. Uh, so I do, if, if you hadn't already done that though, you would just click on new file. But for the purpose of this video, I'm not gonna do that. So I'm just gonna click the backup option and it'll give a message, fail to save the file, which is absolutely fine. And then now we've got an option to go into the mileage changing the mileage to what you want it to be. So I'm going to say that I want the mileage in this car to be really, really low. I want a mileage of, say, 50,200. And that's what I'm going to go with. So I'm going to click OK. Input value, 50,200 communicating. Everything will probably drop off. It has done. And then we've got a new mileage on screen there. So if we zoom in, you can see we've got 50,000 187 so I said 50,200 so it's got us within 13 miles of where we want it to be which I suppose in this particular circumstance is generally quite good um, if you, you can get it within 20 30 40 miles then yeah it's gonna be pretty good but you could play around with the numbers you could go back in and do another adjustment um, and play around with the numbers if you wanted to get it exact so you may you might do something like 50,000 um, 200 and 12 or 13 and it might get you to it might get you uh, 200 for example but that's that's for another video um, adjustment complete on screen and then I can go back and do my recovery if I wanted to which I do everything will drop off again and it's going to recover it back to the 105,000 miles which is correct uh, don't worry about these faults on screen these are not related these are related to a fully ABS sensor believe it or not uh, waiting for a new part coming but we've got recovery successful on screen and it's all thanks to the X Tool X100 kit Pro 2 and as I say I'm going to put a link to this kit in the description below this video and in the comments box below I've done that mileage there uh, correction in under three minutes I could I could have done it quicker if I wasn't talking as well so you can see how easy and simple it is to use and also you know, if you've got, if you've got a, if you're in the business, if you've got a garage, a workshop, a mobile mechanic, and you want to add mileage correction to a list of products or services that you offer, then by all means, this is the tool we'd certainly recommend going for. Uh, so thanks for watching this CarTech video, and I'll see you next time.